Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can work in ClickUp or ClickUp.com. Uh, so first things first, we have to create ourselves an account or log into our existing ClickUp account. ClickUp is a very, very good app for actually tracking your efficiency or assigning jobs for your teammates or employees. Once we are in here in our workspace, we can explore it. Straight away on the left side, we have home button, which is basically the feature of probably every, every single app that we are going to step around. Then we have notifications, we have pools, or the pools overview, which is basically your efficiency online. It's at the moment only me. Then there are goals. We can set them later. Favorites, spaces, dashboard, which is basically my dashboard and documents so assigned to me and so on and uh, way way down on the bottom left part we have our settings as you can see there's andrew big's workspace and then there's andrew big which i created this one uh, just for me so how we are going to invite people into our workspace now we want to go to our workspace on the bottom part and click on people or we can go through settings and then people straight away as you can see we invited uh, two people to join our workspace uh, we assigned them roles as a guests members or admins uh, this one is actually already confirmed then uh, we have settings, as you can see, white label, people. When you want to invite someone, you want to uh, put their email there and uh, select a role and invite them. They will become uh, as a pending, for example, let's cancel this invite. We want to invite a new member and we click invite straight away invite is sent once they confirm they will join our team teams we can create a new one teammate team a we can save it and then we can add members at the moment i only add can only add me because i haven't been able to confirm all the other invites spaces as you can see, there's one with my name in it. Import and ex uh, uh, export files, click apps for some integrations. Also integrations with uh, Slack. Uh, GitHub uh, is very, very common GitLab. We can upgrade uh, for plans. At the moment we are using this one, but it's not paid. It's just a trial, trial till 9th of 9th. Trash, security permissions, and now uh, to my settings. As you can see, we can uh, change the color theme. It's pretty much it. Language, time zone, start calendar, week. Let's go with Monday. Time format, like this. Uh, let's go with day, month, year. And you can really tweak about, uh, tweak everything in here time tracking apps and so on and so on so let's go back what we want to do now we want to hit the home button in the top left side of our screen then there we have lists we want to jump into list number of rows two we can uh, place them where we want them but let's go and click on tutorials as you can see straight away we have our uh, tutorial we can go a uh, new task add the description or comment we can also change the plan uh, or um, change how we want to uh, how we want to look at them like for example board or there's a calendar boards Chance, timelines, and so on and so on. A lot of options, but I prefer a list. Straight away, as you can see, when we are starting, 
this journey we won't be having any of those there will be just maybe comments or assignees maybe custom task ids for example so let's imagine you just created a task task name or type let's go with tutorial click up in we can create a new list click up for example let's go like this and create a task we can open it and you see everything in here new subtask to do or checklist attachments we can upload the files and we can assign them to for example this guy and let's go like this home and uh there are tutorials in ClickUp. as you can see straight away on the left sidebar you have your space which contains of tutorials that i created before and then click up that i just created now if we want to add another task like click up two we can assign uh, assign people description asap asap attachments let's go and the moon moon in which is a png set dates template dependencies and watchers it's still uploading to create a task and, and here we have it one attachment we can review it rename it and so on and so on if we want to have uh, more data straight away in our space we can click on this plus button and go with uh, the options that we want to see in these bars for example uh, date created 25th of august as you can see comments and a very very good one is status for example to do we can convert it to subtasks uh, dependencies add to list uh, we can du duplicate it duplicate the task like that merge add to lineup add to favorites on share and permissions we can share this subtask or this task uh, with people for example it was previously we can add this guy or uh, through ClickUp but those people already have the permission because we invited them into our workspace but we can uh, get for example internal link like this and that's the and now we shared the link and we can share it and uh, we can share the task or make it private or make it public if we make it private not even those people that are not on the list of assignees can watch it we can switch the assignee anytime we want we can kick someone invite someone and so on and so on there are our dashboards we can add more dashboards uh, like this or we can add a workspace for example new one let's go with next like that and straight away we created another workspace as you can see new one also me in it but if you want to go back we just click on the icon of the previous one 
and we are we are in here we can simply if we are done with the task click on to do and it's automatically completed we can still undo it that's a really beginner's guide to to click up so thanks for watching and see you on the next video